Broncos to reach services for that three-minute match. Of course, you can continue to call in at 937-293-0200. You had a chance recently to speak with somebody who's been a, a, a great friend to URS over the years, uh, a volunteer who's looking for other volunteers to help out as well. Tony Massoud with the Civitan Service Club. Uh, he has supported URS for decades. Here's a look at Dennis and Tony's conversation. Today, we're really happy to have Tony Massoud, a former U.S. board member and former officer of the local Civitan Club, but also currently the governor-elect for the Civitans throughout all of Ohio and West Virginia. And you know what's special about the Civitan is they are the only service club that truly focuses all their attention on supporting individuals with intellectual and developmental disabilities. We are so blessed to have an organization like that in this community. And Tony, thank you so much for what you and everybody at Civitan has done for URS over the years. Dennis, it's not only a pleasure, but it's also a great satisfaction for me to be involved with United Rehabilitation Services. Ever since I joined uh, Civitan Club of Dayton, oh, about 24, 25 years ago, we have always been involved with URS. It started when URS uh, transformed from United Cerebral Palsy back, what, about over 50 years ago? Yeah. And that's how long Civitan has been involved with URS or United Cerebral Palsy from the beginning. We are 100 years old here in Dayton, Ohio, as of October 25th this year. So we're celebrating 100 years of serving the community, wow. primarily United Rehabilitation Services. That is great, Tony. You know, and you guys have found so many ways to help, whether it's volunteering or helping with the duck sales, helping with the telethon. I mean, you guys are always there for us. And having somebody with that common mission and vision, I know you guys are so impressed with the fact that Civitan International actually is the only organization around that has a research institute at the University of Alabama. It's it's incredible what you guys do, and we benefit from that, as do all the people we serve. So thank you guys so much for everything you do for URS and for the community at large. Thank you, Dennis. And I want to mention that United Rehabilitation Services, over the past nine years, uses 91% of the donations you receive for helping your programs. Only 9% goes to administration. This is a great, important fact that people who want to donate their monies know that it's local and it's being spent wisely. So I'm asking all my organizations, which I'm a member of many here in Dayton, please help contribute so that the URS organization can help the families in need. Thank you. Thank you, Tommy. Have a great day. You too. All right, back out here live in our studios during this.